Well, it's hardly a month into the school year, and several districts are already being impacted by COVID-19. Yeah, and it's not just Hamilton Southeastern. From quarantines to positive cases, a lot of school districts are making yeah. some changes really early in the year, and that could easily take a toll on your child. Yeah. CBS 4's Aaliyah Blackburn spoke with a local therapist, and she's live right now on how parents, guardians, and teachers can help. Good morning. Good morning. Jessica Hood, owner of Indy Child Therapist, says kids thrive on consistency and routine, but right now it seems like that's pretty hard to come by these days. Though the demand is high right now, Hood says they're still taking on new clients. While most kids are just excited to be back in school, she says it's mostly parents with concerns about the future. Regardless how the school year plays out, parents can help maintain consistency by still doing parts of their normal routine. That way, there's still a constant for your child, no matter where they're learning. Just picking two or three things that are routine that you do the same. So maybe bedtime is routine and, and, and that is the same every day, regardless of where you are. Maybe it's um, making sure that there's a note in their backpack, regardless, or you know that there's like that one thing in their lunchbox that's the same that they can count on um, every day. Parents, guardians and teachers can also look out for anxiety and depression. Hood says patterns like misbehavior, restlessness, irritability or even anger are common signs in kids. If you are seeing this in your child or student, Hood recommends just checking in with them about how they're feeling. And it's also recommended to talk to your kids appropriately about what's happening and why. Hood says how adults present that information to them is critical to their mental health. In the newsroom, Malia Blackburn, CBS 4 News. All right, Aaliyah, thank you.